Once upon a time, in a small village, there lived a man named Ahmad. He was a devout Muslim who believed in the power and mercy of Allah. He was respected in the village for his good deeds and kind nature. However, Ahmad had a fear of Allah that was so great that it began to consume. Ahmad would often wake up in the middle of the night, drenched in sweat, fearing that he had committed a sin that Allah would never forgive. He would spend hours in prayer, begging for forgiveness and seeking guidance. His fear of Allah had become so great that he began to avoid social interactions and spent most of his time in solitude. One day, Ahmad met a wise man who was known for his deep knowledge of Islam. Ahmad shared his fear of Allah with the wise man and asked for guidance. The wise man listened carefully and then said My son, fear of Allah is a good thing, but it should not consume you. Allah is merciful and forgiving. He is the most compassionate and understanding of all. You should not be afraid of him but should love him. The wise man then told Ahmad a story about Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him backslash, who was once asked by his companions about the most beloved deed to Allah. The Prophet peace be upon him replied to love Allah and his messenger. The wise man continued, if you love Allah, you will do everything in your power to please him. You will follow his commandments and avoid sin, not out of fear but out of love. Allah does not want us to be afraid of him, he wants us to love him. Ahmad took the wise man's advice to heart and began to focus on loving Allah rather than fearing him. He began to see Allah as a loving and merciful God who forgives our sins and guides us on the right path. His fear of Allah was replaced with love and devotion. From that day on, Ahmad lived a life of love and devotion to Allah. He was no longer consumed by fear, but instead, he found peace in the knowledge that Allah was always with him, guiding him on the right path. Ahmad continued to do good deeds and was respected even more in the village, but this time, it was not out of fear, but out of love for Allah. The Islamic moral of this story is that while fear of Allah is important, it should not consume us. We should strive to have a balance between fear and the love of Allah. Allah is the most merciful and compassionate, and He wants us to love Him and do good deeds out of love for Him, not out of fear. It is important to focus on Allah's mercy and forgiveness and to always seek His guidance in everything we do. A life lived in love and devotion to Allah is a life well lived, and we should always strive to follow the example of Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him in loving Allah and His Messenger.